Activists for the family of 19-year-old Michael Moore are calling for changes to be brought, charges that, that should say to be brought against the Mobile police officer who shot and killed a teenager. The teenager, Officer Harold Hurst, killed the armed teenager two weeks ago. Activists are threatening protest and unrest if Hurst isn't charged with a crime. News 5's Chad Petrie has the story. For the activists representing the family of Michael Moore, the definition of justice is charges against Officer Harold Hurst. The officer need to be charged, and he need to be charged with negligent homicide, and he needs to be charged with manslaughter. By all rights, he has violated the law. Mobile police say Moore was armed with a gun and reached for it when Officer Harold Hurst shot him during a traffic stop two weeks ago. If he's not charged, Glasgow hinted the community and family would decide the next step. We're going to make sure it's peaceful. But now if we have to shut down that highway over there that stops four states, the intersection of I-10, east and west, the intersection of 65, north and south, then we will do that if we need be. Glasgow says they're not at the point of blocking a highway yet. I see nowhere where we will have to shut down the highway myself, but then again it's up to the community and the people in Mobile, Alabama. That's, right. That's not my call. Throughout the news conference, activists implored anyone who wanted to join them to be peaceful. So we shouldn't put Mobile in a position to have to repair itself. Right. Right. But we definitely got to keep Mobile in a position to heal itself. The activists also said they've asked the police department for a copy of their policy on deadly force and don't have it yet. In Mobile, Chad Petrie, News 5. It could be months before a grand jury returns a decision in the Michael Moore shooting.